Hey everyone, welcome to WD Coders. Today in this video, I want to show you one Angular application demo. First of all, if you are new on my channel, please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so that you will get notification of my upcoming videos. Now you can see I have opened side by side two screens. Okay. And you can see the compose message button here. When I click on this one, you can see one form will come. When you type something in the input box, you can see the suggestions, right? This is shared component, which I have done. Okay. So first of all, I will add some inputs in the form. Okay. Subject also. Now, when I click on the submit send button, you can see in the right side, the message is coming, right? So the socket also I have added here, right? So in the right side, you can see the message is coming. Now in the right side, if I click on the compose message button, you can see form is coming. And when I click on the send message button, the validation also working fine, right? So now in, you can see in the left side, we have the user John Martin. And when you type in the two field, the same name, which we have in the left. Now some inputs I want to add in the subject and then in the body. Okay. Now, when I click on the send message button, you can see in the left side message will come. Okay. So using socket, I am, I have done this. So that also you will learn how you can use apart from this, you can see what I have done. So delete icon also there, different screens also there, send trash messages and also in the right side count also you can see, right? So when you click on the message, you can see that count is decreased. And when you click on the back button, you can see this is read message right now. Okay. So different screens also there and you can see the count also decrease. Okay. So when you click on the delete icon, message will be deleted and this message you can find in the trust section. Okay. And these are the messages which I have sent to the different persons. Okay. Now you can see when I click on the logout, you can see the form is coming, right? And if I want to log in as a John Martin user, first of all, I will type the email ID, John Martin, and then I will add the password here. Okay. And when I click on the login button, you can see the dashboard is coming. Okay. Now I will tell you about the code part. Okay. So in the VS code, you will see, uh, what I have done. Okay. So first of all, I will, uh, I think I need to minimize this one. Then you will understand better. So backend folder I have created in the SSC app folder pages, pages also you can see, right? So when I click on the store state also I have created, right? So now what I have, I need to show you is the different screens also there, right? Messages what I have, uh, how you will show the messages and in the shared folder, in the shared folder also layout also I have created and pipes for showing the date and in the component shared component I have created. This is the input box. You remember uh, when I type the name, how uh, the suggestions was coming, right? So that also I have created a shared component. So that also we will learn about this. So if you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. If you're not subscribed so that you will get the notifications. Thank you so much for watching.